thunderforest.com. Hey guys, so today I'm talking about the new Baby Driver trailer, the new Tequila trailer, uh, which is based off of the song Tequila. And um, this uh, new trailer has come shortly after a new Logan Lucky trailer, so two pretty similar movies. And um, I saw the Logan Lucky trailer, I hope, I hope to have a review for that trailer soon, up soon too. But uh, I felt like I needed to review the Baby Driver one before I reviewed the Logan Lucky one, because I had so much more of a fun time with this new uh, Baby Driver trailer than I had with the Logan Lucky trailer. And that's probably because of how well synchronized the music has been to these trailers. It's like, the trailer is having fun with itself, and it's very playful, and I really like that about these, about these trailers. Uh, Ansel Egort, who knew? I mean, he looks really good in this movie so far, and I'm excited to see how he is in the movie. Another thing they did in this trailer, which I liked, is that they incorporated some of the critical responses from the rest of the critics in this trailer. And uh, they incorporated in clever ways, and I'm glad that they had screenings to put those critics' um, responses straight into the trailer, which is awesome. So I think there's going to be a more positive buzz about this movie. Uh, on top of that, you got a good cast, Kevin Spacey, Jamie Foxx, etc. And um, you also have, you know, Edgar Wright helming the entire movie, so that's something to get excited about. But basically what I really liked about this movie is a, a trailer so far for Baby Driver's trailers, especially this one, is how well they incorporate music. And it looks like it's going to be something that happens in the movie too. And how stylish they kind of look. They look really nice. They're really well shot. And so I really appreciated that about the Baby Driver trailers in general, and this trailer did an excellent job with that. And it looked really good, and it felt really good, and it seemed like an energized film. Which is something I felt that the Logan Lucky trailer was lacking a little bit, but I'll really save that for the Logan Lucky trailer review. So that's all I have for the Baby Driver to Kill You review. Um, I hope to let me know in the comments below if you're going to be seeing Baby Driver or have plans to see Baby Driver. It looks pretty good to me. And uh, that's all I have for you guys today for this trailer.